Hi everyone, today is Thursday, March 19th, 2015, and tomorrow on the spring equinox of March 20th, there will be a total solar eclipse. This will not be able to be seen in the United States. It will mostly be visible over in the Africa areas and such, and in the northern parts of Europe and such. You'll have to check and see exactly what times those will be shown. But another type of eclipse like this won't happen for another 19 years. Yes, there will be more full solar eclipses, but this involves the... It has a supermoon happening on the same day and such. But you can read all about that as you will. We just wanted to show that this, as well as with the new CERN startup, is happening this month also. They're not sure about the date, but this has been associated with opening the portal for, in the Bible, what's known as the fifth angel to come down with the key to open the abyss. Just as right here, you can see Shiva stepping through the portal. In the Hindu legends, Shiva makes up many different um, personas and such, and also comes as the destroyer, just as the destroyer came during the Exodus when Moses went through the Red Sea to escape from Pharaoh. But that, you can see him stepping right through the gate. See Shiva right there, and you can see the 666 on the CERN. But all this is, you know, who knows if we're nearing the actual time of the ends. We're just actually keeping watch. Just as right here on this Bank of America mural, on the main Bank of America, it actually shows right here an eclipse and the woman of the Bible being caught away. And then all of the world rulers, even Hillary Clinton and such, going through Obama and handing all the world powers over to Prince William and blending the red and the blue together during an eclipse. Is that this eclipse? We don't know. We're not predicting dates. In the Illuminati, they're waiting on this individual to come, just like the fifth angel with the key to open the abyss and to let the locust out and such. Well, again, we're just keeping watch, especially around the dates of the 20th, 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. We're not saying that tomorrow during the eclipse a giant a giant cataclysm is going to happen and UFOs are going to come through a gate portal opened and ravage the world. But let's just keep watch. This is where CERN is right here, the Large Hadron Collider. And you can see right here this serpent coming right through the abyss, just as in the Bible it talks of this serpent appearing. See it right there? See that right there in front of you by CERN? There's a lot more here, but we're going to stop right at that. Just to show that that's the serpent coming through. Just like coming through the portal. Just like this. Obama has been associated to this same character. See him doing the Shiva pose as the destroyer coming, the god of all things. See right there. Spider-Man has fought this same type of entity in the Oz Corp. See how he dressed up like the goblin right here? Well, that entity is shown right here by CERN. Right there. Take off the Hydra. See right there, perfect. Coming right through and driving like that winged thing that the Osborne character drove. And you can see the Hydra. This is all over the place. This is like in the new Captain America thing that this is taking over the world governments. This Hydra right there and the Oscorp. Just like that. There you go. Them blending things together or something. So we don't know if, if something's going to happen, or it could be the beginning of something to happen as the world nears World War III and such through there. But let's keep watch through all of these things. So let's head over to Washington, D.C., where they have the same thing mapped out, just like this opening of the abyss coming. This is Washington, D.C., right here. The White House is right down here in the Rose Garden. First thing to remember is that all of this is going by the script of the Bible. It's as a balance. Jesus Christ is, it, it, everything goes perfectly by the script as we near the end of the age and the fifth age. See where it says 50? Right there? Just as right there, you can see that clown figure coming down. See him right here? The Revelation 911 beast that is the king of the Illuminati, the fifth age, coming down trying to blend people with this types of alien things and to do this idol worship. And there's the eagle granted to the woman of the Bible. 
So he's the one that wants to come through the abyss. But it's all mapped out right here. See right here what's called the ellipse? Like an elliptical alignment. There's an alignment with the star systems that everything's waiting on. This is why some people think that they're waiting on Nibiru and that the Lucifer telescope is waiting on the red planet, which is also called the destroyer. And you can see right here See this football right here and a foot kicking it during an alignment just as the Washington Monument is an alignment right there. And you can see the goalpost right through like the circular thing just like the CERN project going on. Just as like I keep showing when the Shiva character, the devil, the destroyer, whoever comes down we go up. We pass over. You can see it right there. And then actually right here in the Bible it's when they, the beast receives the grievous head wound. The reason I'm showing this is, do you see the date in the lines of the road? The 15th, the ball is teed up for the 5th age. The 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th, 21st, 22nd over here is a Passover. The 22nd, the road does not go all the way through. And then on the 23rd, as we've been showing, this represents the throne of the earth. The the Lincoln Memorial, just like the present on the $5 bill, and it represents the throne. And it shows that entity I've shown before falling down at the same time when this football is kicked. First off, you can see the woman of the Bible right here is teeing up the football, just like that. She's the one caught away with the wings of the great eagle. See the football? And everything's teed up. As I say, it's got to be a perfect balance. And then up here, it shows this guy coming down, right up there. This is a whole piece here, so let's do this just right. Just like this right here. Perfect. You can see the woman right here and Jesus go up. See the finger? And Jesus will go to the throne of the world and judge the world. And here is the little horn of the Bible that Illuminati guy coming down and he looks like a bomb. He's going to come through a nuclear event. See him coming right down and receiving the grievous head wound. Then he gets back up and starts doing the New World Order. And Jesus Christ is on the throne and turns the wheel of the Great Tribulation. See the monkey over here as we've been showing about the simian flu will be released. Now do we know if this is this eclipse or is something to happen by the 23rd? We don't know. We just have to keep watch. You know, when, I mean, Obama has two more years. This could happen next year around 322 or so. See all of that right there? Perfect by the scripture of the Bible. And as we keep showing, it's a balance. This cons is considered to be the right-hand side. This is the left-hand side where the accuser sits coming down right then and there. And you can see the dates. And on the 21st, see the 21? But 22 doesn't go all the way through. Only goes to here. It's like passed over. Something to do with that date of the 20th, 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. See him coming down? See the number 23 now? Confess with your mouth. The Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart. God hath risen him from the dead. And you'll be saved. Hallelujah. So that's the same symbol of coming through that door as we've been showing. Just like this. See her going up and then whatever coming down and going inside of the Prince William character after Obama is out of the way. He, his job is to set everything up and to be as Judas and to, just as Judas did, to set everything up for the next stage. Thank you very much everybody. This is real and right in front of us. We do not know about dates. We are just keeping watch. Thank you very much.